Hello, hello everybody and welcome to another tutorial. This time we are going to look at Photoshop and Affinity and how to create new layers from selection. Right, so before we begin and roll in the intro, my intention is to post two videos per week now, one on a Wednesday and one on a Friday or weekend, depending on the type of the video that I'm making. So if you'd like to follow this type of tutorials, please subscribe to my channel, hit the like button and ring the bell to get notified when I'm uploading more videos. Let's roll in the intro and after that, the quick tutorial. In Photoshop is very, very easy. So I have an image here. Let me select a part of the image. And if you want to create a new layer with your selection, right click and layer via copy. So what it did, it created a copy of my selection into a new layer. Let's see how Affinity is doing this. So here we have the same image. Let me zoom out and let's select the same. I'm going to select the pixels. If you try to right click, you're out of luck. It's not working. A workaround is go to edit, copy, edit, paste, or control C, control V, or command C, command V on Mac. And that created a new layer. Strange, isn't it? So let's deselect this. I'll show you another way. You can copy part of your image into a new layer. So let me delete this one. Let's select another way. You can go to refine. Let's say you wanted to refine the edges. Uncheck the mate edges and from output select new layer and hit apply. That created a new layer and hid the layer underneath. So I can go grab the new layer, simple as that. And I will tell you the shortcut for this. So if you select the shortcut for creating a new layer from selection is Control or Command J from your keyboard, it will create a new layer. In Photoshop is the same. So if we go and select, if we hit Command J or Control J on keyboard, you can see that it created a new layer with the selection. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the like button to tell the YouTube masters that this video contained some useful information for you. Until next time, enjoy the video here and here. Take care.